Hey, what's up guys? So you know it's best here. I'm finally back in town from doing some traveling. And what was waiting for me on my doorstep when I got here is the new Surface tablet coming from Microsoft. This is the first Windows 8 tablet. It's actually running Windows 8 RT. And some of the specs of this tablet will be that it does have 32 gigabytes worth of storage. They do have a 64 gigabyte version if you wanted that one. They have the NVIDIA Quad Core Tegra 3 processor inside of it. Two gigabytes of RAM, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth 4.0. Doesn't have LTE, doesn't have 3G, anything like that though. But this will be featuring a 10.1 inch screen. I'll go over some of the specs of that screen here in just a second so without further ado let's go ahead and get into the unboxing of this thing i think i have a piece of tape right there and let me go ahead and slide it out of the box like so so we have two different boxes i guess inside of this one because this does feature uh, the touch cover you can't get this without the cover it will be cheaper i think about a hundred dollars cheaper but i decided to go and get this touch cover because something kind of interesting and new they actually built in a keyboard inside of this uh, protective cover this is really just for the screen itself protecting the screen but inside this protective cover right here so it has a very nice feel to it, a very nice material to it um, and these keys aren't really raised off of the um, uh, the cover itself that much you do have a different version for that if you wanted to but this uh, allows you to really have a very low and slim profile but still be able to use a keyboard um, has a trackpad right there as well so this is gonna be pretty interesting it just connects with this little magnetic click there so I want to of course cover that in my review of the surface tablet here but it's going to get to the star of the show and let me get this tape off of here and see how I open this thing all right just like this just like this all right so we got the tablet right here we got the just the wall adapter here to be able to charge this bad boy up and I'm going to take the tablet out of the box set that to the side for now and see what we have on the inside as far as this and it's really just going to be instruction manuals and I don't want to need I don't need to look at that stuff I think that is about it nothing else is inside the box okay so we have the tablet here you can see it is in a definitely a widescreen type of form factor it's definitely a long tablet uh, but I will tell you that it is pretty lightweight the tablet weighs 1.5 pounds it is pretty lightweight for its form factor a very nice big 10.6 inch screen right here this is a 16 by 9 wide screen display it has a resolution of 1366 by 768 and then we're going to see if I can turn the screen on, see if we have any juice inside of this tablet. All right, there it is. So while it's turning it on, it's going to take a, a tour around the tablet itself. Um, it has a 720p front-facing uh, webcam right there. It also has another 720p webcam on the back there. You can kind of see my fingerprints. I did put lotion on right before this, so this thing does get some fingerprints there. Uh, but anyway, while we're on the back here, I'm going to show you this uh, flip-out stand right here, which will allow you to um, set this on the desk like so if you wanted to, to prop this up. Very nice, very easy to be able to do this. A lot of the tablets, a lot of the tablets, including the iPad, you need to have like a, uh, a, in a case to be able to have that type of functionality to it. Um, let's take a look around. We do have a full USB 2.0 port right here. So you'll be able to connect a keyboard and mouse to this thing if you wanted to. Uh, micro USB. Uh, this thing does come with two speakers, two uh, microphones as well. On the right hand side, we do have the headphone jack and it looks like we probably have the volume controls right there as well. So I went ahead and got the tablet set up here. So I can go ahead and show you the software and just really how the screen looks. And I really like this widescreen format of it. It, has, it gets a lot of information on the screen at once. And also too, you can get it with the Microsoft software. It can slide in from the, the right to the left. And I do that slowly. I can actually slide this in and create a little separate window right here. And I can go ahead and change this divider if I wanted to like so and this is currently loading up my weather or trying to load the weather there but see how long it takes for it to do that pop up and boom there is being weather so if i want to get rid of that i just go ahead and slide that all the way back and i can go ahead and press this uh, home button to get back to the home screen here and it has a lot of good things you can slide over here from this side and you can access like, your different settings different devices start menu go into the settings right there if i wanted to, to change the different things from wi-fi um, other things like that if i wanted to slide back over to get that in there and so again it's just a really quick look at the software running on this tablet i want to cover this a lot more in my review of this microsoft surface tablet really see where it stands like, amongst the best tablets out there in the market it's a lot of people are really interested and of course i'm really interested in this thing as well so anyway guys thanks for watching this unboxing please leave a comment down below what you think about the surface tablet and thanks for watching guys and i will catch you later peace